Hello people and um, here's another Fractured update. Um, filming is literally about to start any day now and um, it, I think it's about time I showed you what equipment I'll be using for the filming. Um, it will all be centred around this of course. This is um, a Panasonic HDC SD700 camera. Um, captures full HD and uh, it's about two or three years out of date but it's a very good piece of equipment. Um, if you want to find this um, online, you can find it for about £300. Um, the reason it's um, cheaper than most Panasonic cameras is, of course, because it's been outdated by um, other models. The latest one is the HDC SD900, which you can find online for about £900 to £1,000. So, um, this one is more cost effective than those ones, and it gets the job done just as well. Um, the next big piece of big equipment, and the reason I'm going for this HD camera as opposed to my normal HD camera, is because um, here it has a HD, um, not HD, um, a, um, a microphone slot, which means that um, you can plug in an external source and use it to get better sound quality with another microphone. And the microphone is, in this elaborate briefcase, um, what's this called? This is the... Um, the uh, Rykoti Softy um, Sen Sennheiser Boom Microphone. Um, if you want one of these, this is going to cost you around 200 to 300 pounds. Um, and you plug it into the um, camera and you get much better sound quality, film type sound quality, much better stuff. And I've also got a boom pole. Which you um, which you plug into the um, boom microphone, so you can you know hold it, get good distance on it, and um, and um, it extends as well. If you just want the pole, it will cost you about ninety pounds. But um, there's no point in really having the pole unless you've got this bit of wire, which um, plugs into the microphone, um, allowing you to actually use it properly. Um, so if you want the um, the pole and the wire, that will cost you around £300. £200 extra for this little bit of wire. It's um, a bit extortionate. And also, um, this boom microphone doesn't just doesn't come with the handle. If you want the handle, then that will cost you an additional £90. Um, how am I paying for all this? I'm not, because um, I'm a university student. I'm allowed to rent this equipment. Um, it's on a three to four day loan and I have to return it and I can renew it as much as I want to as long as I don't you know, break the equipment of course. Um, as for the tripod, um, I'm going to cut to a different angle to show you the tripod. Sorry for filming the tripod on my bed, it's been a very very hectic time in my room recently so there's not a lot of floor space. This is a Velbon DF40 tripod and um, it's got... It's, it can stand around um, I'd say four four feet tall when it's fully maxed out and it's a very sturdy piece of equipment and it's what I've been using to hold up my camera for around the past seven or eight months or so. I recommend it if you want to actually get into filming at least have a good tripod even if you don't have a great camera. And just a few other random additions um, this um, HD camera has a 32 gigabyte HD card which is also on rent from the um, from a university. The one I normally use for my other videos is about 4GB. If you put that 4GB um, SD card into this one, you'll get about 10 minutes worth of footage, whereas on the camera I'm filming now you'll get about an hour and a half, so it just shows the HD difference from that camera to this one. Um, also the boom microphone takes um, AA batteries, um, which you can buy from my university, but I bought them cheaper just down the road at my local shop. And um, that's pretty much it. In terms of um, what I'm doing for editing, I'm probably going to stick with Windows Movie Maker because I've grown so used to it and I know how to get the most out of Movie Maker. If I don't have a lot of time and I have to edit from home a lot, then I use that. But if, um, I'm give if I have a lot more time um, on my hands, then I'll probably go into the university and use... Um, something much better, um, maybe something from Sony or Adobe or whatever um, editing software they have. But yeah, that's um, pretty much everything. Panasonic camera, 
um, a Rycott boom microphone, also a Rycott um, boom boom pole, and just a few bits and bobs. A Velbon tripod. I'll put some um, links in the description to all of these products where you can probably get them the cheapest if you want to. Like I said, it's probably if you're just starting out on making videos or making films or anything that requires filming, I wouldn't invest in any of this. Um, you can get a cheap HD camera for about £100, and you don't even need a HD one. As long as it gets the digital video, you can get started right away. And you don't need a boom microphone, I'm just choosing to use this because I want to try and make this a professional thing. And of course, I've got the option to rent all the equipment, which is a great bonus for a student. If you are a student, then feel free to rent this equipment, so even if it's just to learn how to use all this equipment. Um, so that's all from me. Um, thanks for the recent upturn in subscribers recently. Um, last time I made a vlog on this channel I had about 140. Now I've got over 230 or something like that. So thanks a lot for all turning out in droves. I didn't realise so many people would be interested in this product. Filming starts either tonight or tomorrow, which I'm really looking forward to. And um, expect another video sometime in the next week detailing how that went. and how directing is going and how I do my thing. So um, thanks a lot and I shall see you guys next time.